What is going on guys? So today I'm coming at you with a quick little video about Thanksgiving and what that is like in the military. So honestly, I did a video on this last year, something kind of similar to this, you know, talking about Thanksgiving, what Thanksgiving is like. And I'm gonna kind of do the same thing because I know basically nobody watched this video last year. Nobody was really around on the channel last year when I did this. So I'm just I'm just redoing it, I guess you could say. This is like my first real redo of a video. So we're gonna talk about Thanksgiving, what that's like. I know obviously if you're watching this right now, if you're in the military, if you're in training, you know what it's gonna be like or you're gonna shortly experience it like tomorrow, I believe, is when this video is gonna be uploaded. But if you have a family member who's in training, in military, and you're kind of curious what the difference is gonna be from the day to day or just really if anything special is going to happen that's kind of what i'm going to talk about in this video so the day-to-day -day, you know if you're in training like for example ait or basic training if you're in really any other training scenario like if you're an airborne school or something or i don't know i don't know if ras for ranger school i'm pr probably sure maybe maybe they do something but honestly i don't know for a fact but i would assume that you're just going to go up throughout your normal day-to-day and the only thing that's different is after like the duty day is over after all the stuff that you have to get done is over there's going to be like a special like thanksgiving dinner although in my opinion if you're in a training environment it's not going to be the nicest dinner in the world you know in my experience it seemed like the the defect dinner the dining facility dinner that we had it was kind of like an accumulation of all of the different DFAC meal items that were like Thanksgiving is related, you know, like turkey stuffing and things like that, you know, all of that stuff that was like Thanksgiving food, they basically just put that all on one meal and that was the Thanksgiving dinner. It wasn't really anything special, like it was still like the same turkey that we would have. Sometimes you have stuffing, it was still the same stuffing. So it wasn't like anything special, you know, if there's cake or something, it's still for me, for example, for me, I was in AIT whenever this all happened, you know, it was just the same cake, the same, the same desserts and everything. The funny thing though, is I'll probably overlay some pictures, is they generally have, at least in my experience, a whole bunch of you know designs and desserts and stuff that are decorations like food as decorations that's more thanksgiving related but you actually can't eat any of it like you can't touch it you can't eat any of like the this food that looks good that you might actually really want to get you can't actually have any of it so that's kind of funny so training scenario i'm sure that's kind of how it is but i do know that especially kind of like if you're you know in the the real army it's probably going to be a little bit nicer and i guess the one coolish little thing that happens on thanksgiving in the military is when you go to the dfac for this special thanksgiving dinner the higher ups are going to be the ones who are serving you the food normally it's like the cooks and the lunch ladies or lunchmen whoever it is that's working there sometimes you know the the military hires civilian workers to you know work at the dfac you know so it's not going to be them it's going to be your higher ups and that's like your first sergeant your company commander your battalion commanders, your sergeant majors, all those kind of people that you don't normally like talking to or you try to avoid, those are gonna be the people who are serving you the food. It's kind of a little cool, but it's, you know, it's they, they kind of make a big deal about it. Um, I remember it was there was a lot of hype for me, you know, when people were telling me about Thanksgiving dinner and everything, like it was, you know, so great and everything. It, it wasn't that great to me, it was just normal. Again, I was in a training scenario whenever I experienced this, and then in the normal military, you might have slightly better food, but I wouldn't expect like, you know, like you're going over to your grandmother's house for Thanksgiving. So that's pretty much it, honestly. Thanksgiving is a normal day with a slightly above average, you know, Thanksgiving related dinner with your higher up serving you that dinner at the defect. It's kind of how Thanksgiving is in the military. If I could have just summarized that in just one sentence of this video, that's pretty much what it is. But that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button. That would be awesome. If you want to stick around some more of my videos, hit that subscribe button. That would be even better. Or you can hit the notification bell button if you want to be like the real MVP. Follow me on Instagram and Snapchat if you haven't already. I hope you guys have an amazing freaking day and have a great Thanksgiving because again, I'm pretty sure it's tomorrow. So, you know, don't go too overboard with all the food people. Don't go too overboard because you're just going to have to hit the gym and work it all off the next day. So, have a great day, everybody. I will see you later. Yeah.